some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. I don't know if you know this, Savtard, but you do realize that when you, uh, well, travel through the state of Florida operating your vehicle on the public roadways, you're supposed to have your driver's with license with you at all times. But, you know, I guess you smooth brain soft hearts just don't realize that you got to have some sense of personal responsibility in this world. Otherwise, things will go to shit. So you don't have a valid license? I don't travel with a license, though. Well, okay. So, do you have a registration for the vehicle? Um, yeah, I mean, the, the vehicle's registered. Okay. Can I see the registration, please? Um, yeah, you can it up. What is your name? What is your first name, sir? My first name is Brett. And what is your last name, Brett? Um, my last name is not relevant. That, it is relevant. It is relevant. This is a traffic stop. So go ahead and identify yourself now. I'd, I'd rather not do the whole jail spiel. But do you mind giving me your first and last name and your date of birth, please? My first name is Brett. And your last name? My last name is PV. PV. And what's your date of birth, Brad? Okay. And do you have a valid license? Um, I don't know. I don't travel with a license. You don't know if you have a valid license? Well, that basically means that you know you don't have one. Because anybody with a valid driver's license would certainly know if they have one or not. You're not exactly the sharpest knife in the drawer, are you? I mean, no wonder these soft tart gurus were able to get to you so easily. I mean, you can't even think of a uh, convincing lie or anything like that. You're pathetic. Okay. Have you ever had a valid driver's license? Um, yes, I used to have a, a valid driver's license. Okay. Okay. So you're not quite, like, maybe, maybe? Do you mind if I turn off the keys so we can use the key to open the door? Absolutely. 6-5, Randy, Obi. First name, Brett. Last name, PV. He advised that he might not be traveling with a license. Everything's broken. The handle's broken. Yeah, no. <laughs> You having a good night? So far, so good. Are you guys aware that the vehicle... Uh, yes, we allowed that to happen. You allowed that to happen? Yeah. Why would you allow that to happen? Um, because this is our private conveyance. This has nothing to do with the, uh, the state any longer. Okay. Once again, you moronic dipshit of a sovtard, you do realize that Florida law requires you to have your vehicle registered, no ifs, ands, or buts about it, and they'll send you a nice friendly letter in the mail reminding you that you have to register your vehicle after you purchased it. And with that being said, you also mentioned that it is your private vehicle. Well, dude, as far as driver's licenses go, again, there are classifications within Florida that denote whether or not you can drive a commercial vehicle 
or just a regular passenger vehicle. So you might want to look these things up, especially that pesky tent the mimic, you know. I mean, that gets you soft tards every single time. And I know you think that it doesn't exist because you never read the Constitution. No, not a sovereign citizen. Are you portraying the normal amenities of a sovereign citizen? Um, not a sovereign citizen. Okay. But it's your nowhere. Okay. You understand that having a vehicle that isn't is not registered for more than six months is criminal, correct? After the second offense. Um. I wasn't aware of that. No. Okay. Well, Brett, I'm gonna ask you to do me a favor. Go ahead and step out of the vehicle, okay? What for? Just go ahead and step out of the vehicle for me. Uh, Under a Pennsylvania v. Mims, I am requesting you step out of the vehicle, okay? Um, oh my gosh. P Pennsylvania v. Mims, this case like... all that dictates that I'm allowed to have you step out of the vehicle, okay? So I'm going to ask you one more time politely to step out of the vehicle, okay? I would like to speak to your supervisor. Is there one? Sergeant's right here. Fantastic. Oh wait, the supervisor's already there? But I so wanted to use that uh, Randy Marsh Karen meme uh, for this situation. But dang it all, I can't do it. But wait a minute. I'm the one editing this video. I'm the one that dictates whether or not I could put that meme there. So roll that beautiful meme footage. I want to speak to your manager. Sorry. Step out of the vehicle, okay? Out. Okay, don't, don't. Nope, step, step out of the vehicle. Step I'm out asking you. Step step out. Out. I'm going to step out. Step out. Take step your out. hands off of me, step please. Out. Step I'm out. not asking anymore. I'm telling. Step out. Excuse me. Step I will get out. The vehicle. I will get out. Step out. I don't need you. Step out of the vehicle. Step out of the vehicle. Your hands off It's not that hard. Step Officer out. Clark. Step out of the vehicle. It's not that hard. Come on. Step okay. out. Step out. Okay. See? I'm coming See? out. Yep. Step out. Step out. Step out. All the way out. Face the vehicle for me. 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 Place your hands behind your back. Place your hands behind your back. Excuse me. Place your hands behind your back. What are you doing? What are you doing? Don't. Clark. Stop. Clark. Take it easy. Why are you doing this? Don't play subtle. Clark, we're gonna get this. Stop. Oh, stop. Comply. I'm complying. I'm complying. I'm complying. Why am I being asked? Why are you complying? Why am I being asked? Why am I being asked? You got, you're gonna tell me why I'm being arrested? I mean, like, Brett, seriously? You're not being arrested, you're being detained. Oh, come on. But you're now you're being arrested you. for resisting. No, no listen. I'm not please, resisting. Please. I'm. Compliant. Uh, I'm just confused. It seems a little odd, doesn't it, you guys? What have I done? I'm gonna step back over here. Yep. No, no answers. Step back right here. Sure. Yeah. yeah. Face the quick platform. That's okay. it. Yep. Yep. And just spread your feet for me. There we go. And just lean forward at the waist. Okay. Um. Yep. Oh, okay. Lean forward. Lean into this. Yes. Okay. Right there. Perfect. That would be on me, that would poke, stick, hurt me, any way, shape, or me, any knives, guns, drugs, anything like that? Oh, God, no. Okay. He's not identified himself yet? He's identified himself. Under duress. Correct. Correct, because you're required to identify yourself on a traffic stop. Correct. Oh. It's just Florida statute. Well, that's... Do you want her to get this? Um, yes, please. Okay. That would be possible. Awesome. Great. You been arrested before? Uh, yeah. Uh, same thing? Um, yeah, same thing. I mean, driving, miss, confusion. I mean, what do you I don't mean? need... What's, what's confused? Well, what are you confused about? Well, I mean, driving isn't a... Well, it's a commercial endeavor. I'm I'm not out here in commerce. I'm not making money, you know, taking my wife to the store, getting something to eat. I'm just going... Oh, I got a question for you. I got a real good question for you. If you're not driving in commerce at this very moment, then uh, what happens if you're driving to work? Because, well, that could be considered commerce right there because you're providing a service to uh, a particular employer to uh, exchange your labor for uh, monetary value. So, that's essentially commerce right there. So your entire argument right there is, 
rather asinine for not keeping up with your driver's license and uh, insurance and, uh, well, your registration. So, you got any more dumbass uh, arguments? Traveling up there in my private conveyance? On you guys our are... public roads. Well, there's, I mean, you're allowed to travel privately on the, on the roads. You Absolutely. You have a driver's license to do so. Well, only if I'm license. involved in commerce. I'm not no, involved that's not in true. commerce. Listen, I'm allowed to. On your own private property, you can drive. This is not your property. There is a private easement on every road. A private easement on every road. So that's your logical argument right there. A private easement on every road. So therefore you can travel on the roads, on the public roads, without uh, having a driver's license or anything like that. Well, they just told you you can only drive without a license on your private property. And those private easements are not your property. They're other people's property. Man, you really don't think these things through now, do you? I'm beginning to wonder what your uh, overall IQ is. It's got to be below 60. Incorrect. So, no, as, as far as it goes, you're being placed under arrest this evening for resisting without violence and for driving for, with, yeah, correct. understand that? No, I do not. Okay, what part don't you understand? Um, all of it. Okay, well, we'll I'll, I'll explain it a little bit further while we drive down to the jail. So we'll get that part explained. We're going to off to the side. We're going to walk to the back seat and see if it's okay. Go ahead and have a seat for me. For that, you need to find arrangements for this vehicle. We'll start calling around to see who can come get you in the vehicle. Um, legally, it can't be driven on the road, so keep that in mind. Otherwise, we're going to have to tow the vehicle, okay? Sir. Sir. I'm not going to give you a Christmas card this year. It's expired two years ago. Uh, this can't drive. Colby. Colby? Oh, really? Yeah, so I, they passed us. I pulled out of the Circle K and they immediately turned down Long Acres. They knew they were going So. Huh? It's me? I'm not the one that broke the law. Is it? And resisting without violence. It is a law. Yes, 322.34 to be exact. Sure. 31, 20, like 10, 15, 10, 12, 51 of the jail. If that's what you believe, sir. If you said, if, if that's what you believe, sir, I, I greatly apologize, but. Today, you're being under arrest for two Florida state statute violations, okay? As I've explained, it is driving, specifically driving, chapter 322.34. That would be very explained. Yes, you were. You were behind the driver's seat of the vehicle and occupying the driver's seat. Traveling, driving in the seat of the vehicle that has the steering wheel is the same thing. And then you are also being placed under arrest for resisting without violence. Okay? Resisting without violence? Resisting without violence, correct. I mean, I'll charge you with violence if you prefer. <laughs> well, Soft Heart, uh, you got what you were asking for. You got yourself arrested. Uh, I mean, a two year out of date tag alone is just going to be enough to get yourself pulled over to begin with. And uh, I uh, think you really need to work on your soft hard arguments because uh, they tend to fall apart like burnt paper. In other words, yeah, get yourself a new brain and use it.
Oh, boy, you are a total moron. So, at any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one. Dude, so there's no way I can get in, bro? Come on, I'll put you on my YouTube. But shut up, Wesley. You gotta put signs up, ma'am, if it's- Are you Glenn Serio? Who's that?